The Ag Ambassador Award was created to recognize individuals who have gone beyond their normal range of activities in promoting Mississippi agriculture. It's not presented every year, only when Farm Bureau feels that it has been earned. Barbie Bassett hasn't always been the polished, informative television meteorologist that she is today. She grew up on a farm in the Delta, where she was expected to help her brother and sisters with chores around the farm. Although my dad worked another job while he also farmed, he was an in-town postal carrier, um, he worked from sun up to sundown and sometimes past midnight when it came harvesting season. And I really think that I got the, the work ethic that I have now from growing up on a farm. Growing up, Barbie had a close relationship with Farm Bureau. Well, you know, it really started when I was in junior high we would have the talent contest, the Farm Bureau talent contest, and I was a part of those and um, actually won a few of those district competitions. And when it came time for me to be a senior in high school, I was encouraged by my county Farm Bureau office to enter the Miss Farm Bureau pageant. And I did, and it just went from there. And to say that I was surprised was just an understatement because it was not my first pageant to be in, but it was the first one that I had some serious competition with. You may also remember her as an MC at many talent and Miss Farm Bureau contests here at the state convention. But what propelled Barbie to receive this award is her association with Farm Bureau's Ag Image Campaign. Well, I was asked to do that commercial, and in reading the actual script for the commercial first, I said, well, my parents are farmers. Why don't I put the part in there where I say, like my parents, uh, in there? And the production crew said, that's a great idea. <laughs> and most are owned and run by Mississippi farm families, like my parents, not large corporations. Farmers are also good conservationists of Mississippi's natural resources. But so I've been pleasantly surprised at the week. number of people who would email me or send me notes, send me letters, or even call me here at WLBT and say, I didn't know that you grew up on a farm. Um, and, and they want to know more about that lifestyle that, that I had then. And I really think that being born and raised on a farm, that has really uh, catapulted me into a trajectory to go into meteorology because in the fourth grade I realized at a very early age the importance that weather had on the economy in our home and the climate <laughs> in our home. If it was a bad season, my dad was stressed out. If it was a good season, hey, maybe we could go to Clarksdale or Batesville and buy some new clothes. And so for the Ag Ambassador Award for 2011, we choose WLBT's Chief Meteorologist, Barbie Bassett. I'm just uh, humbled beyond words. I will tell you that I think everything that I needed to know to be a meteorologist, I learned from my daddy being the farmer. Number one, don't get on television and say, we hope it doesn't rain this weekend for the golf tournament. Because daddy said, I may need some rain. And number two, don't ever stand in front of the seven day forecasts. <laughs> Always move. I will always do whatever I can um, in word and deed with the media, even being chief meteorologist there at WLBT, to bring attention to the family farm and to the need that you have, whether the weather is sunny or whether it's cloudy and rainy. I hope to always get the forecast correct for you and what you need. Thank you.